All right. Let's do a ready check. I was just kidding. Hit four and fucking eat. H Town out there, you guys okay? They probably had kid, uh... Kid aggro? <laughs> Them kids should be asleep. So anybody live uh, in Ohio? Sorry, what'd you say? Anybody live in Ohio? Who? Anybody? No. I'm hearing it's hard to breathe over there right now. That seems crazy. Yeah. Why? Why? What's going on in Ohio? Uh, the train derailment. Basically, oh, really? like, uh... Wait, a million me. tons of, of a poisonous gas escaped from a fucking train or train. something like that. Laurie? In, uh... 1971... A train ca carrying military munitions... Exploded in the Roseville train station completely removing Roseville from the map. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah that was in you read, California. Read what Sacramento. Skull said. Rather than rather than doing through doing the work of moving the trains that flipped over and everything, they blew them up and then did a a, a slow burn on this poisonous liquid. Great. Yeah, it's like 150 square miles. They're they're recommending people um, Five, potentially evacuate. Four, eight, yeah, they they basically two, nuked the town. One. The age of the and then they, they, they the, the nerve of the company. The company offered uh, each resident a thousand dollars for um, what was it that they they said on the news? <laughs> Inconvenience. Inconvenience fee. a little more than an inconvenience at that point. Can I put the circles in the right spot? Yeah, well, if we wipe, I'll kind of explain Beware. something that'll make it a lot easier. We'll be left standing. That was my fault, sorry. It's okay. And I'm off the... Off We're chilling. Oh, off we go. We get back okay. on? Nope. That's why the tank. Alright, let's wipe it. Let's wipe it. Just jump. Let's wipe it. Yeah, DPS all has to be on the same side, all grouped up. Yeah, uh, you, you can have everyone on the same side. Beware. So I'll, I'll show you guys what uh, what, what we do with our guild. You don't have to run back. Beware. Nothing will be left standing. Jump off. Jory, don't be a hero. Your end was yeah, so the boss needs to stay in the middle of the platform, um, and so we didn't really need the the tank Finest to be on the other side because, right um, again, that that first breath in in phase one, it, it just picks a random person, so everyone just needs to move away, and that's why some guilds like they they have everyone just stack in one spot because there's really no like tank and spank. It just the boss just does damage. Now in phase three is when the the tank needs to be on the other side. Um, so what happens is when, when the tank pulls, 
generally it's best to just walk right up to the boss so that the boss just stays there. Um, grab aggro, and then everyone could honestly stack on the tank if they want. Just when that breath goes, everyone needs to make sure that they, they move to one of the sides. Um, there are the little like circle, blue circle things that, that pop up and shoot lightning on the ground. So you can just kind of like inch out of those, but they don't really do too much. Then when there's the, the bombs that, that hit three people, you're just going to move one of them behind the group. And again, you don't need to go all the way to the edge. You can just go to like kind of halfway between the edge and halfway through the group. You actually get to see the radius it grows to before it explodes. So it puts that big electric radius around you. You just want to get that electric radius right outside of the group and then let it explode and then walk back to the group. And then when it slowly grows, it'll grow up to the size of that radius. Um, and so that's where you want it to be. It's just right at the edge so that melee DPS could stand in it and still DPS the boss the whole time. And as long as Raz stays in her little circle, it's really easy to plan everything out and not drop any DPS. Um, but yeah, the three people that get the bombs, generally it's just like one over here, one directly in behind, and then, and then one over there and make sure to stand in it so that you get the, uh, the, um, you don't get knocked back. Other than that, should be good. And yeah, just keep everyone on this side. Um, Cause it's, it's, it's just a lot easier. It's easier to heal too. Yeah, stay grouped until we need to spread. Yeah. Light Arduino, please eat. Hi, Green! Hello. Is that Kujo's wife? Yeah. Oh, you ask her how she's doing. She says she's good. Okay, I'm happy to hear that. Uh, I guess Green's the only one in here. <laughs> Catcher Doc's Catch got jealous. You, you used to say hello to him, too. <laughs> All right. Uh, everybody's ready. Starting for. Five, four, three, two, one. Charge! The age of the incarnate begins! Yeah, these are some good bomb placements for sure. Beware. Nice job, guys. Walk away from breath. Oh, Two that. people down on breath. Oh my god. Yeah, it's, you gotta be quick. You gotta watch it kind of ahead of time. Uh, can Beware. we VR the tank? We can probably still work on it. And uh, everyone stand on the, the thing. Don't take the battle res until uh, after the push. Alright, back out of the thing. Did the tank get a BR? Not yet. Oh, okay. Um, the only one uh, that can uh, do it, heals, I believe, defenses. is uh, the DK and uh, the Warlock. Beware. Alright, get out of the breath. Oh. <laughs> and now get in the puddles. Beware. Nothing will be left very standing. Alright, out of the puddles. So you're ready to spread out. Beware. The elements answer to me. Well, and make sure to interrupt to or CC your own spark. And that's basically phase one. So it's just Beware. Oh yeah, you went through it. Yeah, it's just you just keep doing that same thing over and over and over. It just goes through those four, four phases, like Beware. four pieces, and then that's phase one. Yeah, the sparks definitely need to get hit. That's that's the real raid wiper in this, uh, in this um, phase. So you basically, whenever those sparks are about to spawn, you just watch yourself. You make Beware. sure that you're targeted on the spark if you're using an interrupt. 
um, and then you interrupt it. You have actually a good amount of time to kill your own spark. So Beware. I know a lot of people will like panic and they'll throw their interrupt at the boss and then they won't have anything. So you've got a lot of time to like take a step back after it drops and then click on no. it. And does the spark show up right next to you or does it, show, it, it show always up anywhere in directly the directly on you? Oh, okay. so yeah. So anything that would interrupt a spell cast, because all the sparks are just casting a spell. So anything that would interrupt a spell cast works. So stuns work, but Let roots don't. Slows don't. Knockbacks work. Stop by um, Like, I mean, I, I don't know if you can like charm it or anything, but generally most classes have like an interrupt or like a knockback. I think. Yeah, like pretty much everything should have something reliable. You just want something that that has a under a 30 second cooldown just because it happens about every 30 seconds. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh food is going down. Somebody standing in the food. And those big circles if we could just drop them back just a tiny little bit, just a bit. Yeah, yeah. I thought the the circles were definitely a uh, a solid one. I, I think we did the circles really well. You can definitely push them back just a little bit more if you want. Just make sure that there's at least one close enough. But again, you see that circle around it, so you can kind of see where it, if it's going to hit anyone, you want to like inch back a little bit more. And, and did I hear you correctly say that that when you get that, you stay there until it. Uh, no, no, no. When you drop down the bomb, you just run back to the group after it's dropped. And then when the boss does the knockback, you're going to want to go stand in a puddle. Okay. So you just pick whichever puddle's closest. Because I thought um, you could stay there. Yeah, and, and when, it, when you drop it down, sometimes the boss will do a lightning breath right after. So you got to make sure to, like, get out because it, it, the, the puddles slow you down. Yes, that's what happened to me. I yeah, guess. it happened. H Town Duke, you guys need to eat. Cracking, you ready? And and tanks know when to taunt, right? Yeah, DBM stab. Yeah, every every stack. And uh, and the other thing too is because you're generally going to get taunted off right after you get a stack. Um, the time you're going to take the biggest damage is right when you taunt back because there's like a small overlap before your dot leaves. But honestly, I think you guys were fine. I wasn't, I didn't even really need to heal you guys that much. You ready, Kraken? Waiting on Alethea. Okay. Starting pull. Five, four, three, two, one. The age of the incarnates begins! All right, palms. Breath in five seconds. Beware. Owie. You gotta die. Everyone, everyone get inside a puddle. Beware. What's the deal? And battle res the tank after. 
Well, I won't be doing it. Oh, both tanks mm -hmm. dead. What's the timer on battle res? Wipe it up. Yeah, let's just wipe it. They're gonna get in the circle. Jump off the edge. Beware. What's uh, killing uh what's killing you, Greenstone? I took three hundred eight thousand damage with the electrified jaws. Oh, so it, it just wasn't taunted off. off? Yeah. I taunted as I had four stacks of it. Yeah, oh yeah, that needs to be taunted every stack. Is Kraken in Discord? Yeah, he's there. Okay. Yeah, it, it doubles the damage you take every stack that you have, and she already does pretty good damage. Even if you're geared, she can she can chunk. If there's a threat issue, like if you're considerably more geared than Kraken, um, you might want to slow down on DPS after he taunts and just watch your threat. Make sure you say like 99%. No, Kraken's uh, he's at 385. He should be fine. Okay. Food is down. So is DBM telling me wrong time to taunt? Uh, you just taunt every, every time that the other person gets a stack. So, I don't know when he gets a stack. Do you have um? Do you do you see like his? Uh, I don't know what action bars you have or whatever. Um, yeah, you can set them as your focus, and whenever he gets a just a debuff, it's a it looks like a blue Razageth head. It's like a little blue dragon head thing. Or you guys can just call it out on Discord. Like I mean, I can try to call out taunts as well, but... No, it's alright. Too much talking, I start getting annoyed. And I want to punch people in the head, so please, don't. <laughs> I'm laughing at what Cadredog said. What I said? You're glad you marked him. He didn't know who to kill. It's hilarious. Yeah, I tried to set his focus, but it doesn't give me a thing to watch. Everybody's ready. Let's give it another shot. Five, four, three, two, one. The age of the incarnates begins. Don, please. Taunting. Beware. Nothing will be left standing. Yes. Oh! You missed the third one. Taunt, please. Beware. 
breath, watch out. Beware. Nothing will be left standing. Don't when you can, Craig. <laughs> yeah, that ain't gonna work. What do you mean that ain't gonna work? Blew me right off the platform. Okay. Yeah, but you can get red if it puts you back up. No, oh, I had not. resed him before, so he didn't have a res available. Beware. Nothing will be left standing. So, when I said taunt please, taunt please, did you get the DBM warning Beware. about those? Yes. Okay. Alright. So, DBM is working, it's just... Uh... My eyes aren't. Yeah. <laughs> you got the coin? That's how you got the bargains. Yes, we can do one more pull if everybody's willing to do one more. No. The next one will be my last one. Okay. You guys remember to stand in the puddle before the knockback? Um, because not only is it is the directions a little funky with the knockback but sometimes it's just buggy and you'll fly right through it so it's it's always best to just stand in the puddle first even if you lose a bit of dps or whatever it's fine um so whenever that knockback's going out and then laser again make sure to pay attention long after the circles to go down does the knockback occur um it it's like 10 seconds or so um DBM will tell you if you have it up to date. Uh, it'll it'll say like knockback. She also like says something and she gives you like a she's like casting something for four seconds. It's the only thing that she really casts. Um, I get right she casts her lightning ring, but she casts the the knockback. So you just need to figure out what she's casting. If it's lightning breath, just move away. If it's the knockback, go hop in a puddle. Um, I believe Death Knights also have like. It's like no one can stop death or something, but I, I wouldn't rely on it. It happens right, the knockback happens right after lightning breath. It, it sometimes times out that way, sometimes it doesn't. The first time it always times out that way. Yeah. So lightning breath and then it's, and then it's the knockback. Ready, sorry. Yeah, I thought death's advance was prevents any kind of movement impairing effects on yeah that's what it's called so it, it does work but I, I wouldn't rely on it I would just it's really easy to just go to a pool alright ready check to go well it's like I had a double knockback and the first knockback put me in one of those pools yeah, that's why you don't get out of the pool. The knockback lasts like five seconds, and if you get out of the pool, it knocks you back again. And it does the damage again, too. Just a reminder, I won't be available tomorrow. I have dialysis, so... Um, Sunday we'll be doing the alt raid. Monday as well. More than welling. Alright, starting the pool. Five, four, three, two, one. Charge! The age of the incarnates begins! Taunt. Breath incoming, watch out. Bombs out. Oh, no, no, no. Out, 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 out. Not Beware. in. Beware. Right. That's a bad place for my on the sticky stuff. How do I always seem to get in front of the breath? I'm dead. Beware. Nothing Thank you. Be left standing. <laughs> on 
salty now for Kraken. He's low health. Electrified jaws on me. Taunt, please. Beware. Breath. Avoid it. All right, everyone, get in a puddle. Beware. These winds peel flesh from bone. Taunting. Beware. The All right, make sure to interrupt me. your own. I don't see it. What? Oh, there we go. All right, those those bombs have got to go out. Can't bring them in. It worked. Beware. Nothing will be left standing. Get in the big puddle. Beware. Beth, avoid it. That's a wipe. Um, all right. So next Wednesday we will be starting on him or her. Um, yeah. It, they, whatever you want to call it. Um, remember, if you need to get bosses in, come to the alt run on sa uh, Sunday and Monday, and you will get some bosses in. All right, for your vault. All right. Thank you very much for all the help, everyone. Uh, for the shaman that, that helped us on that, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, I'm a rude asshole. Don't don't worry about anything I said. I wasn't trying to. Never um, take yeah, it. Never take anything I say seriously when I when it comes to stuff like that. Nah, you're good. All right, cool. And uh, just just be aware, everybody. This is what we're going to be working on. So if you want to go to LFR, if you want to look at videos, if you want to uh, read stuff, go ahead. Um, it's going to take us a little while to get it down. And once we do, we'll be moving on to Heroic. So be aware of that. I'm going to bring uh, my Demon Hunter instead. That's fine. <laughs> you can... It, technically... If you what? feel more comfortable, as long as you're not doing a healing or tanking spot, you can technically switch between DPS characters whenever you want. Right. Well, it, it doesn't matter. The raid basically is built so that it allows that. I'm just saying, warlocks don't really have an interrupt. And I could. well, well, I thought the I thought the uh, the fell dog or whatever it is had an interrupt. Yeah, I can read to you what it says. Um, it says that it counters the enemy's spell cast, preventing any spell from that school of magic from being cast for six seconds. Yeah, so that one works. Or if you have like a stun, I know a lot of warlocks use like the, I think it's called like Shadow Fury or something. Oh, um, okay, I've got that. Yeah, and then um, you can you could even just like fear it if you don't have anything else. But I know a lot of locks generally will use the 
the Shadow Fury. Um, I don't know what your cooldown for Shadow Fury is, but they pop up in the in Phase One. They pop up um, every minute or so. Yeah. Um, in Phase uh, Two, it pops up every thirty seconds. Okay. Um, as a warlock, you can use your Fell Stalker as an interrupt. That's what I have. And yeah, that would be the easiest because. It, yeah. I I tried to click on it and do it, but it didn't. Didn't go away. Doesn't, doesn't the the big guy, the guard, I forget his name, the fell guard, doesn't he have like a, uh, a stun as well? It's, a, it's that fell off that I read. That's, that's what they've got. So, anyway. Learned a lot. <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it's a fight that has a lot of mechanics. Once you get the mechanics down, they're actually pretty easy. It's just that there's a lot of mechanics. Like yeah. every phase has a bunch. There's there's one phase in particular where the there's like a big ad that's teleporting, a bunch of little ads you have to kill in CC, and then you also have Raz that's just carpet bombing the done. stage the whole time. That one is usually where guilds will will have a lot of trouble. Um, and that's that's like phase like two point five, so it's it's pretty it's just a long fight. I mean, you generally bloodlust twice on that fight. Okay. It looks like siege on Dragonbane Keep is going to happen in eight minutes. So if you haven't done it uh, and you need it, you should go over there. Well, thanks so much, uh, Grim, for helping us out. That was really yeah, yeah, of course. Absolutely. We really appreciate it. Yeah, you guys will have it next week for sure. Oh, if you can make it and help again. <laughs> <laughs> I if you if you let me know, um, I might be able to. I I've got a few characters, so I usually this is my my fifth one. <laughs> I've already leveled like four, so Yeah, my guild we do we do um, normal on Friday, and then we do heroic on Saturday, and uh, but we all have a bunch of characters, so we kind of just try to find random groups uh, for our alts, so we don't do a lot of alt runs. But yep, GGs, you guys have fun, and uh, I'm, I'm sure you guys will have it next week. So all right, well, thank you very right much. On. Yeah, of course. GG guys, good progress. All right, take care, Club. All right. It was a very good night. Well, I mean, we planned on killing it, we killed it, and now we're uh, close to the end. So, hopefully, we get it down. Can you only upgrade your tier pieces once a week? Say again? Can you only get that little thing that upgrades your items to tier pieces once a week? Uh, no, you get you get them from... Well, yeah, I think you do only get it once a week, but uh, you get them from doing different things. So, if you don't do it that first week, it I think it accumulates. You know, like, it's like, let's say two weeks go by and you don't do it. You'll have three of them instead of just one, you know? But you have to do the questing, you know, as long as you do the questing, as long as you do the... should work. But I'm not sure, because they they kind of changed it all, and I'm... and I, I... I look at it, and it says account bound. And if you have more than one uh, tune, it kind of confuses me, because... What if you use it on one tune, does it affect the other tune, you know?
You're going to the siege, right, Green? Yeah, the frog is up here already. Carabito, uh, are you going to do Dragon Bane Keep, or are you too much in pain? I'm in a significant amount of pain. I'm going to go to sleep. Good night. Good night. I'm going to Watch take painkillers and try to the sleep. And the rest I should have taken like before the pain. I have hard. them set at certain hours. I don't want to overdose. Oh, but I mean, you should be putting on the patch as soon as you sit down for raid and take. I can't put the patch on right now because of the irritation on my back. Ah, okay. So the lighter cane, you can't put it on because of the the operation. Right. You're right. You're right. What about uh, if you get like, excuse me, sorry. If you get like one of these heating pads and and put it into the chair that you're sitting in. To no, keep this you back one home. has a vibrator though. I just had to hook it up, which I didn't. I'm all right. I just that's enough for one night. Too many hours sitting. Not good. You said at 393, you start getting 392 rewards? I don't know. What he said. What I said? No, that's what Skald said. Oh. Confusing. 393, you start getting 392 gear rewards. Level 64 on my Paladin now. I, I've been lazy, I should, have got, I should be higher. Uh, what, what were you? 64. 64? Alright, alright guys. I gotta be in the back of the ball game at 7. At 8 a.m., so I'm probably going to head out. What position are you playing? The aspects have returned. <laughs> grandma. I'm playing grandma. Watching. Grandma watching? Yeah. And there are three games tomorrow, so I'm going to be sitting on a bench all morning. It's 8, 10, and 2. Well, at least you don't have a machine sucking the blood out of you and putting it back into you well, for four hours, so... They're trying to keep us out with fire! <laughs> Show them we dragons But I'm not as young as you. Yes, that's true. But I'm not saying anything about that. That's your business, not mine. <laughs> it's just that, you know, it, it hurts to sit on, a, on benches for that long. I guess I could take my chair in. You don't have one of the, uh, what is it, the... Uh, I don't usually click it to basketball, but I probably should. You get one of those things, the, the, the seat cushions they use in cars for people with, uh, oh. hemorrhoids. Right, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's supposed to be my bad. They sell them, they sell them in Amazon, they sell them like in little kits, you know? Yeah, but it's mostly, like I said, it's mostly my back. No, oh, my butt. <laughs> it's pretty well bad. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> it, was, it was a good raid night. It was a good raid night. Really thought it, everything went really well. I, I really appreciated that Grim guy explaining things the way he did. It really helped. He got the I would find. And with that, you have 
given us started well, rolling. I think he did that Thank because, you. you know, some people don't hear, you know, everything, you know. He was throwing us a lot of information. Yeah, that, that he was, and uh, that's why I appreciated that he gave details, but after a while, right. he gave the details and then did it again, and that's then did it again the third time, and I was like, okay, you gotta shut up. Okay, but that's why I said, you know, he said, well, you know, somebody's gonna mess up there, and I go, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be the one that messes us up, let's go. <laughs> right? Because so, I agree with you. He was, he, he, I, I was ready to go. The thing is that put the video to it, and if everybody, if everybody would watch the video, they would have been able to glean the same information he gave us. So, yeah. You know. yeah. Um, Jory, are you there? Um, yes, I'm here. I'm I'm sorry. Glad, um, glad that you said what. Were you kidding when you when you said what you did to Skull? Well, sort of, but he's like he's constantly licking everyone and then writing stuff like rub scat all over, and it's just it's starting to get really annoying. I agree. I agree, and I was glad you. And that's why I was like, how old are you? Because is he like a kid? I don't know, honestly. I've never heard his voice, so I don't know. He gets he gets pretty rude, and he'll say he, he'll say things about Carol, Carol Vito and uh, Yeah, he said something about you, and I don't know if you picked up on it, because no one said anything, so I didn't draw attention to it. Well, no, I don't usually read that, but I can imagine it wasn't very flattering. Yeah, he he called you a real genius or something rude like that. So I was like, I'm not even gonna like draw attention to his comment. Yeah, I feel I don't know. Is he like a kid? I, I can't tell. I think he has his sarcasm button all the way up to twelve. You know. Yeah. It gets to be a little much in more than one way. You know? Well, he does the same stuff all the time, but it's like some of the stuff like he does he just spams over and over about farting and I'm just like not in the mood sometimes. Yeah. And and he he's 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 just rude a lot of the times. Yeah. The yeah, I noticed like the other week he called um Carabuto old or something. Uh -huh. Yeah, he's he said that about me too. That old lady keeps talking Every yeah, so that it, it sounds to me that sounds like a kid, because an adult doesn't consider other adults old. Yeah, I think Carabito's ancient, but you know he's only two. Years old. <laughs> yeah, but you, you know what I'm saying. Like, he's saying like if, he's saying it like a way that like it, like the way like a kid. No, kid, I agree. Uh, I agree. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so Caravito is only two years older than me, so I was totally teasing. <laughs> Where are you, uh, Green? Say again? Where are you? Where am I? It's done, we're done. Oh, I didn't know we were done. <laughs> Where have you been? Check your bags. You should be either a pink or purple bag, or, uh, uh, you know, a blue bag. And you can open it up, and there should be something in there. Yeah, I also got a 379, too. Yeah, I, got, I got a uh, 385 uh, plate head. Well, neither piece is good for me. I don't know what goes on, but like, we'll use the, the siege as an example. My mini map gets this border around the edge, and it makes it hard to see your arrow when I'm trying to look for where you went to. Oh, um, 
Your mini map, you mean? Oh, your yeah, regular map. Yeah, and I don't have an add-on or anything. I don't know. I I I don't have that issue. I don't. And I got tons of add-ons. You guys see all the add-ons that I'm always testing and playing around with. Hello. The the community feast. I'm sorry. The community feast says 44 minutes until it starts, which might not be accurate because when you put your cursor over, it says 29 minutes. So I don't know. I'm logging. Good night, guys. Night. How are you? Take care. See you around. I think I'm gonna jump on my paladin and just do lobby instances. Well, before, before you do that, what's up? Well, you were gonna set, help me set up weak orders for that community piece. The the weak orders? Yeah. You never installed it? Yes, a long time ago. When you talked about uh, uh, helping me set it up, I had it on. Well, I mean, at this point, we don't uh, we don't really use. Oh wait, uh, what do you need the weak auras for? Do you do you want them for the rares or do you want it for the actual fight? I want them for the rares or the community fee. Okay, so yeah, I can hook you up with that. Get into get into the group with me right now. I'm on green, well, so... I had to enable you, uh, weak orders, so I'm reloading. Okay. Yeah, because I still have not got rid of the quest for the community fees. There's, uh, there's a quest that shows up when the community fee starts. It's on the right-hand side facing yeah. the boss. It's, uh, there's this little dude named Pleek. P-L-E-E-Q. And all you have to do is basically follow the instructions that the boss gives you, and you you get the item from him. I got a quest that says I have to do the community piece five times. That's the one I... No, no, no. You don't have to do the community piece five times. You have to do five task in the community feast. Oh that's wrong. So here's the thing, you're going to get this list, and it's a really big list. You're going to have to find a place to put the list on your screen. So that's the only problem with with this, uh, the weak aura thing, alright? Okay, I got it open up. As soon as you turn it on... Uh, Click on that. Yeah, I clicked on the thing by the mini map. Oh no, click on this that I put in party. It says Greenstone Malfurion High Dues Dragon Flight Helper. Do you see that? Yeah, but the the only problem is I'm I'm having a problem again on clicking on stuff in general chat again, and I can't remember how I fixed it the last time. Okay, let me see your screen. So, go. You know how to share the screen on yeah. Discord. Right? Let me see your screen. <laughs> 